Welcome to today's Friday morning devotion. Today we're diving deep into the theme of love that glorifies. We've been exploring a love that transcends the superficial, a love that reflects the very nature of God. In Exodus, we encounter Moses atop Mount Sinai, enveloped in the cloud of God's glory. It's a moment that transcends human understanding, a glimpse of the majesty and splendor of our Creator. Similarly, on that first Christmas night, the shepherds beheld the glory of God as angels heralded the birth of Jesus. These manifestations of God's glory point us towards His nature and His presence, captivating our hearts and drawing us closer to Him. But how do we, in our daily lives, reflect this glory? The answer lies in our relationships, particularly within our families. Our love for our family serves as a testament to God's love for us. Whether we find ourselves surrounded by loved ones or navigating the complexities of broken relationships, our primary aim remains the same, to glorify God in all that we do. In Deuteronomy 6, we encounter a pivotal passage emphasizing the importance of passing down God's commands to future generations. Our families, rooted in the love of God, serve as vessels through which His glory is revealed. It's a reminder that our greatest purpose in life isn't merely to fulfill our own desires, but to bring glory to the one who created us. But what about those who may not have families or whose family relationships are strained? The truth remains unchanged. Our ultimate purpose is to glorify God in all circumstances. Whether we're surrounded by family or journeying alone, every moment presents an opportunity to magnify His name. The beauty of the Trinity offers us profound insight into the dynamics of love and relationship. Just as God exists in perfect unity as Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, our families reflect a glimpse of this divine community. The love shared between spouses and parents and children mirrors the love that binds the Trinity together. As we navigate the complexities of family life, let us remember the profound responsibility entrusted to us. We are called to nurture and disciple our children, imparting to them a deep reverence for God. Our love for our families isn't merely a personal endeavor, but a reflection of our love for God Himself. So whether we find ourselves in moments of joy, or amidst the challenges of family life, let us anchor ourselves in the truth that our greatest calling is to glorify God. May our love for our families and for others serve as a beacon of His light, drawing hearts closer to Him. As we conclude our devotion time together, let us commit ourselves to love that glorifies, a love that transcends boundaries and magnifies the name of our Heavenly Father.